Hey, what is up, my crazy subscribers? This is Joe King John City Fun. Today, I'll be talking about the new Modern Warfare Season 1 Pass. If you guys have not aware yet, there's going to be a new free content coming up in December 3rd. It's going to be a lot of maps, new operators, new weapons, a lot of cool stuff coming in for the game. So this is something amazing, to be honest. The last time I remember they did something free, they only gave away like a little bit of content. Maybe like one free map or one free weapon or something like that. But like, yeah, um, it's amazing how many things are going to be added in December 3rd. I knew it. I knew it. They're going to be adding stuff before the new Christmas news come in. So it was just way too obvious they were holding a bunch of the content till that month. So, um, yeah, so let's start off with some of the details. Of course, the game is going to come out December 3rd, uh, during right before Christmas. So that means they're going to be sending a lot of games in during Christmas, uh, during Christmas vacation. So uh, also they're going to be adding the new maps from Call of Duty 4, uh, which is Crash, Shipment, and also Vacant. Now, the one that I kind of hate is the freaking Vacant map. It's a nightmare to play, but still fun though. But at least they're bringing in new 6v6 maps because the current ones are not that good. So, uh, except for the 24-7 shootout map, that one's actually decent. At least they made one decent map so far. Um, anyways, moving on to the next new thing they're going to be adding. Of course, they're going to be adding new weapons. Uh, they're going to be introducing a new assault rifle and an LMG. Uh, the assault rifle is the Ram 7 and the Hogar 26, the LMG. Not that bad. I'm hoping the Ram 7 can actually dethrone the freaking M4A1. Because the God damn it, that assault rifle has been dominating over the past few weeks. It hasn't been nerfed. It hasn't done anything. But it's, this is not as bad as a 725. So uh, it's, it's not as bad as a freaking shotgun. Because that shotgun really dominated for, from every single map in, you know... For the first few weeks of release so um i'm just hoping you know they're, they're adding more weapons and that's a good thing new new things to work with you know really to unlock and new attachments and all that stuff um another thing they're gonna be adding of course they're gonna be adding new multiplayer modes which is called reinforced gunfight infected so that's not bad actually um wait gunfight osp sorry <laughs> sorry i was saying like gunfight gunfight's already there but gun gunfight osp is a technically rich 2v2 mode with a twist begin with just your fist and gather equipment as as the match progresses. Wouldn't that just be battle royale? <laughs> well, alright, whatever. But yeah, like, uh, yes, yeah, it's, it's alright. It's good. Reinforced is a hybrid of Dom and Search and Destroy, a single life mode with both teams competing for control of the three flags. In fact, that is not that bad, but I'm hoping, I'm hoping there is like a 10, you know, a 20, a 20 player lobby for this, because if it's just a 10 player lobby, it's not fun, bro. If you guys remember Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, they had 20 players lobbies. And that was fun as hell. So, um... I'm hoping this infect the mode does bring in a lot of players into one lobby. So, uh, anyways, uh, another thing they're going to be adding, of course, new special ops, which I don't even play, to be honest. So, there they are. <laughs> so, it's, it's, I still don't play special ops. That that freaking meme is going to stay alive for the longest time. Also, they're going to be adding new operators, which is Barra and Nikto. Uh, to be honest, I'm really not excited about that. It's just skins. They don't do nothing special for you, so they're just there. It's not as bad as Black Ops 4, though, but yeah, they're just there. Also, the last thing they're going to be adding is the freaking Season 1 Pass. Well, it's for free, by the way, so it's not a Season Pass, so whatever. It's a Season 1 thing. So it's going to be doing like the... They're going to be doing like the Fortnite thing, you know, with the free cosmetics and all that stuff, like the way Black Ops 4 had it. So that's a good thing to have some free stuff along the way and unlock more cosmetics for your characters, or if not for your weapons, which is camos and more little chains on the freaking gun. So that's about it. Pretty much uh, a lot of cool stuff coming up next month, which is good uh, a lot more things to keep you interested i knew they're gonna be bringing in content like every two to three weeks it's because that's how it seems like it's gonna go so uh pretty much towards the end of december we're gonna have new things coming up too so it's a good thing they're releasing a lot of good things like this because god damn it man the game was so i already felt like it was dying it's like they keep reviving it on the last freaking one hp they have and they're gonna be like, okay time to like add more content to it so uh, I, i'm guessing they're keeping an eye on the how many players are playing per week and if it drops a certain number they have to add new content so i'm guessing if this one does last for a while they're not gonna add content till february but if the game crowd starts dying that's when they can start adding more content which is kind of weird um at least it's better though but they do have a roadmap coming up so um so that's it guys that's pretty much the details of the season one 
uh hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you guys really do make sure you subscribe it's gonna be more quality content coming up and more tips especially for the mp5k and also the ak-47 these two weapons are coming up for the best class setup so uh that is it make sure you subscribe for more and i'll see you guys later